Hi, we are back with another video on the topic what is virtual reality. Before we deep dive, please make sure you subscribe to Scalers YouTube channel and don't forget to turn on the bell notification icon. If you have any doubts, feel free to drop a comment below. What is virtual reality? Do you want to visit the moon, swim in an ocean with thousands of fish, or play a game of cricket with your favorite team and players, or be inside a game as a playing character? We know the answer is yes. But how is it possible? Will you can study hard and become an astronaut, or learn swimming, and one day you will be able to visit the moon. What, what about now? What if you sit back at your home and swim with the fish or walk on the moon? All of this is possible with virtual reality. So, what is virtual reality? Virtual reality or VR is a way of experiencing things and digital realities made in the image of the real world. But several other things make us relive the moment or experience things with the help of our imagination. Such as the world inside a fantasy novel, monuments painting, movies, etc. But why are they not called virtual reality? VR is a concept that can be perceived by physical senses, not just the sense of viewing but also about feeling. And the feature that sets it apart from other things is that it is interactive. VR is used in several simulation based fields such as pilot training, the medical industry by surgeons and by chemical researchers for understanding the chemical structure of certain chemical compounds. With so many applications in entertainment and sciences, let us learn more about virtual reality. VR is a real-world interpretation of the digital world. With the help of sensory devices and computers, augmented reality is created. Digital reality is experienced with VR goggles and other devices, which gives the sense of touch. These devices include a headset, gloves, and several other devices. Essential Features of Virtual Reality Virtual reality is one of the most advanced technologies that have been developed. And with the help of AI, artificial intelligence, it is taking the world towards achieving something great. Therefore, let us understand the different features of VR that make it so enjoyable. First, believable graphics. The graphics embedded with real world elements play a significant role in providing an authentic experience. Therefore, VR has high graphics that make you believe that everything is real and not an illusion. The graphics make you feel that you are in the real world, not one created digitally. Second, interactive mode. What sets VR apart from books, paintings and movies is its instructiveness. It allows you to feel that you are in control of your surroundings and can interact with other elements in the world. If it's not interactive, it would be similar to watching a movie in 3D, but that's not virtual reality. Third, use of high quality computer systems. Virtual reality is about detailing and finishing. The digital world can face several glitches if the computer system does not have high in graphics or processors. Therefore, one of the essential features of VR is that it is being broadcasted through a high end computer system. Fourth, should be explorable. A virtual world should be explorable and must have detailed and significant features to provide a rich exploring experience. It must provide you with a 3D view of the world and not just a linear representation similar to paintings or movies. Fifth, must be immersive and interesting. For virtual reality to be interactive as well as believable, it must be highly engaging. The main purpose of VR is to make it highly attractive so that everyone interacts with it. Paintings, books, and movies summarize an event. But VR allows you to experience events as if they are happening to us. VR lets us relive events and memories, visit unexplorable spaces, and understand structures closely and interactively. You see what you want to see, experience what you wish to experience. However, there are several types of virtual reality. With these things in mind, we have prepared this session to help you learn VR fundamentals and the types of virtual reality. Types of virtual reality. 
VR is often regarded as a lucrative term used to market video games. However, the games and 3D movies that claim to be set in VR carry a tiny portion of virtual reality. They are neither very immersive nor have better interaction. Additionally, several simulations also claim to be built on virtual reality. All these meet only a small portion of VR. However, there is a broader aspect to it. Therefore, let us understand the broader context of VR. First, fully immersed. Fully immersive VR is almost identical to the real world and highly interactive and engaging. This type of VR is the original sense of what virtual reality is. Therefore, let us see what is required to create a fully immersive virtual reality. First, a rich and detailed digital world made in the world's image that should be highly plausible and provide real life experience. Second, a supercomputer connected to different sensory devices that records our movements and instinctively detects in this virtual world. Third, a sound surround system that provides us with a sense of hearing of the virtual world. Fourth, a linking device that connects the digital world with real world movements. The most effective way of creating a fully immersive virtual reality is by creating a room that is a sound surrounded system. It has screens mounted on four sides to portray perspective in the virtual world and sensory devices that transmit movement into the digital world. All these setups will provide the best virtual reality experience. Second point, non-immersive. The next type of VR is non-immersive. For example, in flight simulators or a car racing video game setup, the user does not experience a 3D view of the virtual world but views it on a two-dimensional screen. Therefore, let us see what is required to create a non-immersive virtual reality. First point, a widescreen that displays the virtual world in a two-dimensional view. Second point, headphones or earphones that provide the clear output of the sound. Third point, a controlling device works as a device used to transmit information to the digital world. Fourth point, in cases of a flight simulator, a flight control system which has gears, gyro, handles and brakes. Fifth point, in cases of a gaming system, a joystick and a driving system. Non-immersive VR is generally used to create 3D models that can be viewed on a 2D screen. They provide you with a better understanding of the structure or artificial experience of flying an aeroplane. Third, web-based. Several virtual realities are mainly based on web applications and HTML codes. These are generally used by several applications and even Google to provide better results. These include maps, location-based applications, which provide a 3D view of the locations. Fourth, augmented reality or AR. Augmented reality is an effective way of providing real-world information in real time. AR embeds itself with the real world and provides us information about the real world connected to it. In the next section of the video, we will discuss the different applications of VR to understand that it has applications in the gaming industry and in industries that will directly help us. The uses of virtual reality. In this technologically advanced world, there are several uses of virtual reality for different purposes. They are used in the medical field, tactical field, educational and entertainment field. What people believe that VR is only limited to gaming and entertainment, which is not true. Therefore, let us understand all the applications of virtual reality. First, education. There are various applications of VR in the field of education. It can be used for education purposes, such as elementary classes, to make them more interactive, and also in professional courses to make the students more practical. Let us see examples where VR is used for educational purposes. First, it is used to train aeroplane pilots. Several simulations are made on VR to train pilots on how to fly flights. Second, it is costly, dangerous and life-threatening to teach someone on the plane to fly them directly. This is where VR comes in. Third, a simulation is responsible for providing a better learning experience by giving lifelike VR. VR is used for in many engineering institutes to teach students different aspects of machines, structures and programming. Fourth, it helps you to walk through different aspects of learning. You can also use it to teach small children and make the process of learning more interactive. Second, 
different fields of sciences. Virtual reality has several applications in the field of research and the study of sciences. It is challenging to study what happens inside a chemical structure or how a particular innovation will react. With the help of artificial intelligence in VR, it has become easy and insightful to study different aspects of science. It helps create a new drug and studies its effects when brought in contact with several other elements. It allows researchers to understand different aspects of their research and make better observations. You can use it to explore different structures of engineering. Third, medical application. When it comes to medicines, people think there is very little application of VR. It also allows you to study how the medicine will work when you take them. Let us understand how VR helps in the field of medicine. First, it helps in understanding how medicine will work when they go inside our system. Second, it allows testing how a new medicine will affect the body. This helps in reducing the risk that might occur. Third, it helps in developing new medicines to cure diseases that are harmful to humankind. Fourth, it helps in the diagnosis of different diseases and study better. Fifth, it helps surgeons understand different aspects of surgery that is tackle a surgery and see if complications occur. Fourth, industrial design in architecture. VR comes in very handy when it comes to architecture. It helps the architects to learn different aspects of civil engineering. It has features that enable engineering to create virtual structures and study various aspects of them. Therefore, let us see how civil engineers benefit from VR. First, create virtual structures for clients so that they can understand the layout better. Second, it helps in making engineering decisions based on simulations. Third, it helps several electrical engineers to create new electronic models by assessing consumption virtually. Fourth, it helps in preloading designs for engineering products. Fifth, gaming. It is believed that gaming is the field where VR is used the most. Several games such as Minecraft, Warcraft and Battlegrounds use VR to allow better gaming experience. Therefore, let us see how the gaming industry uses virtual reality. Create lifelike games that provide its users with the best gaming experience. Play sports related games with the help of sensory gadgets that transmit real world actions into VR. Use of simulators to make the gaming experience lifelike. Sixth, entertainment. There are many applications of VR in the entertainment industry. These include 3D viewing of movies or traveling to exotic places without moving out of your bed. Therefore, let us see the uses of VR in the entertainment industry. Creating a real life virtual world that one can experience with headgear. VR gadgets take you virtually to exotic places deep inside the oceans, on the moon, or even a different galaxy. Viewing action and fantasy movies make you feel that you're a part of the movie and everything is happening before your eyes. How virtual reality works. VR works by transmitting lifelike virtual images to the brain in a three-dimensional form. It creates a digital environment in front of the user and allows them to perceive more through their physical senses. And with the help of a certain device, it provides sense of touch. First, when you wear a headset, it transmits images that are of the highest quality to your brain. Second, the screens and sensory devices increases the sense of touch and perceiving. Third, this allows the user to feel that they are virtually present in the video or the game. Future of Virtual Reality Due to the uses of virtual reality in various fields and applications, it is safe to say that its future looks hopeful. Statistically, the market value of AR-VR technology is projected to rise to 15.5 billion euros by 2022 and have a CAGR of 77% by 2023. The usage of this technology in different industries and the steady feature, usage, improvements contribute to this expectation. First, medical industry. The use of VR would revitalize the medtech industry, especially for training. Plus, patients can reach out to their doctors and show their systems via telemedicine software. Second, retail industry. Virtual reality solutions is expected to improve the position 
of the retailers in showcasing their offers to their clients in a more interactive manner. This enhances customer interactions and their shopping experience. Third, collaboration work. Communication tools with VR technology would improve the ability of workers to collaborate with their associates better. What's more, many top event manufacturers are focusing on AR VR chip generation like NVIDIA, Huawei, Samsung, and Spectra. A report shows that the AR VR chip market would increase at a 23% CAGR by 2026 due to high demand in the market. App download would become easier with VR adoption, like Web VR, which works with virtual reality. Here, users can directly stream their AR VR content on their devices without native apps. Such adoptions will only increase in the future, with more service providers showing their interest in the scope of virtual reality solutions. Indeed, with the integration of IoT and AI, there are endless possibilities that they have come forward. Therefore, the future of VR is on the right track. Bottom line, all things considered, VR and assisted technology of AR are seeing significant improvements, only expected to grow. From getting a better understanding of historical data in video format to improving the functionality of services in different applications like telemedicine, there are notable benefits of VR in various aspects. The user's entertainment experience gets better with virtual reality services and would surface the current streaming video services. Indeed, the immersive quality of the VR services allows users to engage with the content better and find it more enjoyable and easier to understand. Plus, the interactivity and life-size imagery improve the overall experience further. Of course, further advancements can occur and consumers are welcoming to the possibilities for the most part. With time, the future of VR and the consequent profit rate of the service providers will only increase. Hope you guys enjoyed the video on what is virtual reality. Please don't forget to like and share this video. For any queries, comment below and we'll get right back to you. Thank you.